A very powerful reporting feature Smartlead has is the global analytics section, which you're probably visiting and trying to understand how it works. So let's go over this very quickly. What's this representing over here is the total number of leads that have been reached for this particular campaign and the overall metrics such as your sent, replied, open, positive replies, clicked, and bounce rate. Now, if you have your campaigns set up in a way where you don't have open rate tracking, then that's perfectly fine. This number will not be available and you'll just have your reply rate and your positive reply rate. And what we want to do over here is we want to click on the filter because the beautiful part about the global analytics is you can actually go ahead and select multiple attributes, such as multiple campaigns, where you want to go down and you know test all the multiple campaigns that you want, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Or you can go ahead and select all the analytics specific to a client. So when you go ahead and create a campaign, which you will see in other videos, you can go ahead and allocate a campaign to a client. And when you allocate a campaign to a client, you can come over here, click on the client and look at the overall client specific analytics and performance as well, which will give you a good understanding of how your client it, client's campaigns are performing. Not only that, you can go ahead and adjust the date range over here that will show you the traffic and data as to how it performed. Do note, this date range does not reflect this range over here. This is the overall analytics of this set of campaigns or set of campaigns that belong to the client. This date range is representative of this information over here. So not only that, we get some really, really interesting insights with respect to the amount of data, like you know, tags that have been assigned or not assigned, how many are interested, not interested, the overall channel breakup if you're using an omni-channel approach. But also you've got a very, very cool mailbox over here where cool setup over here where you've got the total number of sender accounts uh, and we've broken this down over here to keep the, the variety in the demo account where you can see the number of email accounts that have very good reputation that need any action some that have 70 to 90 some that have below 70 as well so this will give you a nice understanding of what these mailboxes are that are being used and you can easily click on those open those mailboxes review why they're not performing well most likely something to do with either blacklisting or the domains are not working well and therefore delist them from the campaign so this way you can be proactive with respect to your analytics and reporting. Not only that, you also get to see your lead quality, which gives you an understanding of whether the lead source that you used for these campaigns or list of campaigns or clients are of high value and leading to good deliverability due to just a bounce rate being high or low. Now, if we scroll down over here, this is the cool part where you can actually go ahead and see the email deliverability report. That means each mailbox that we have over here, these nine ones, right? Which one is performing really well and not well on a top line let of metrics such as the open race, uh, the replies that they've received and the clicks. This gives us a very straightforward, no bullshit answer to, is this mailbox performing to the level I want you to perform? Sometimes mailboxes in general don't perform well. Sometimes mailboxes perform really well for a certain set of customers, but not for other set of customers or leads, right? Interchangeable. So you can go ahead and review that over here and make all the decisions you want. You have the access to the information. Now, on top of that, we got the campaign activity, which will show you if, obviously in this case, I've just selected one campaign but if you select uh, five to ten campaigns or if you go ahead and select a client level you'll see all the campaigns as well over here which is a very similar view to the uh, email campaigns view where you get to see the status of the campaign the sent messages the overall open rate the overall reply rate and the overall positive reply rate as well you can even click on this over here to take you to the actual campaign itself and review this information uh, if you like on an individual campaign level as well so I hope this makes sense. It's a very powerful experience to go ahead and help you to go ahead and drive towards strong, strong, strong analytics that will keep your relationship with your customer or your client extremely tight as well as with yourself and your team so that you can be reactive to drive revenue-based activities that will positively grow your business. So thank you. I hope you enjoy this. Uh, check out the other onboarding videos to help you out, understand the rest of the product to make sure you get the maximum out of Smartlead.